Arnold Sahana was the first person to receive a COVID-19 vaccination in the Kimberley community of Beagle Bay. What followed was remarkable. When they seen me have my vaccine and I didn't have any after effects, I think that's what encouraged them all to have it. This Indigenous community is one of the first in Australia to hit the 90% double vaccination rate. Leaders, including Karina Sebastian, lined up for the jab and the local health clinic worked hard to get the rest of the community on board. Verbally going out and face to face to see families and um, members of our community to see if they've been vaccinated. There's hope Beagle Bay will inspire other communities. Get your mob vaccinated, get your community vaccinated, get your family vaccinated. In WA, less than a quarter of Indigenous people over 12 are fully vaccinated. Unfortunately, Beagle Bay is an outlier and the vaccination rates for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people across WA are the lowest in the country. Remote communities in WA have been closed since the start of the pandemic. Now that vaccination rates are so high, leaders are turning their attention to reopening and welcoming back tourists travelling along the Dampier Peninsula. Beagle Bay wants to be among the first to reopen early next year. We you know we still have about nearly 45 to 50 tourist cars coming in a day, you know, and it's because of our icon that we have. I think Beagle Bay was the first to get the needle. Uh, I really think Beagle Bay should be the first to reopen. More than 18 months after closing to the outside world, welcoming back visitors is now a real possibility. Jackie Lynch, ABC News, Beagle Bay.